So you just want one basic object to look at another. Not a problem. Start with the fresh actor blueprint and whatever static mesh you want. Create a new actor type variable named target and make sure that it's visible and editable. And for demonstration purposes, we'll just be using the event tick. So drag out a set actor rotation and from new rotation, drag out a R interp. And then from target, drag out a find look at rotation. And from start, we're gonna get two get actor locations. Set the first one to self and the second one to the target variable, then drag them in like so. Then drag out a get actor rotation and a get world delta seconds. And at this point, this number determines your turn speed. Save. And now if you drag your blueprint into the scene on the right under details, you will see your target variable. You can set it to any object you want, you're done. If you run the game now, you will see your object constantly looking at the target. Now let's say that you're working with a turret and you want the rotation to stay level with the ground. Well to do that, you're gonna right click and split the structs for new rotation and the return values. And at this point you just connect Z. And now if you run the game, you will see that your turret stays level with the ground. Hope that helps and as always, hope you have a fantastic day and I'll see you around. <laughs>